Good morning, everybody. Can you turn that down for a sec? We left Horsham this morning and we've come to Matawa, which is my hometown. I was born and raised here for the first half of my life. And we've just set up. It's going to be raining, windy, and really miserable. But we're set up and we've got the awning up so that we're not absolutely miserable. Um, they've got markets on tonight, so we're going to go and get some money out and go for a bit of a drive it's fairly windy someone said someone commented and said that um do our kids ever fight and i think that's amusing because our kids always fight <laughs> don't ya you little rascals the devils i'm gonna drive i'm on my way around here so I'll drive for a bit. I've got some people I want to meet up with while we're here. And it will be good. After this, we'll probably go to the Grampians. Um, we're still not sure how long we've got before we need to run away um, back to Aubrey Wodonga for a funeral. So we're just one and two nighters, I think, until we know what we're doing, just so we don't miss out on the Great Ocean Road. Come fix what? That. Whoa. Is it broken? Okay. Millie, show me your hair. Turn around. Your ring dings. Um, can I do that for you? Can you see yourself? No, can I do it? Can I do it for you? No, I'll do it for you. No, I, I want to see your beautiful face. No, I want to see your beautiful face. Oh, do you think I look nice? Yep. Can I see your back, beautiful? See my beautiful back? <laughs> look at my daughter. Look at that one. She goes, can I see your back, beautiful? Can I turn around? Yeah. You can see your back. <gasps> I can see myself. Very dark. Oh, what have we got I going on here? We can do that. We can do that. Hey buddy, what's up? It's a bit windy. You're still super hungry. You're starving to death. Dad didn't get you anything. Very windy. I don't know what it's gonna be like. Nothing on your bread. Nothing on your bread. You don't want bread. I ate that buttered sandwich thing. Yeah, you put back in there. I pulled the bread out and I was like, oh, why is it wet? <laughs> oh, is it really? It's because it's so hot. It's because it's left open and in the sun all the time. Who leaves it open and in the sun all the time? Show me your, um, show me your singlet, Tan. I shaved Peter, but I left his singlet. <laughs> He's got a hairy singlet under there. Eli's made a tree house. Kids are loud. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Oh. Um, Thanks, babe. $25 a night. $25 a night powered for an entire family. Power. Awesome. Max and Elijah, are you guys coming? Grab your bikes, please. Can you please twist this? Thank you. Oh.
there. Used to be full of water. Used to be. Used to be full of fish. Fish? And everything. Yeah. No, it's... Water, not a lot anymore. But this whole area is so different now. There was never any shapinas in it. We're moving back, honey. I've already bought a house. Except for these ones. 99 cents. Good morning from another day in Matoa. It is raining. We, I am bringing the kids and Pete to the stick shed. It's one of the most iconic things of Matoa, I suppose. The old stick shed. Daisies blooming Sundress swaying in the breeze can't stop staring You've put a spell on me And I hope That you never Decide to set me free The way you're moving It's got me moving my own feet The greatest feeling that I could ever dare to dream Is you forever moving next to me Let's not waste time or take this slow We've got miles behind us but miles to go So let's just break this down To the simplest truth Have we got our $20 worth of information? Sure. Of looking? I think so. More about supporting the town for me. Giving the town 20 bucks to bring my family to come see this cool thing they might not ever see again. I'm about that.
just the enormity of this place. Like that's the walkway out there. Can you imagine this full of grain? <laughs> Ooh There's some grain over there still. Over in the corner over there. It's very smelly over there. Yeah, rotten. Very old rotten grain. Sawdust. Good morning. We've packed up Matoa and we've come to the Grampians. This little town's called Halls Gap and we used to come here as a kid. I'm excited to take the kids to go and get an ice cream. Oh, ice cream! You want an ice cream? You want an ice cream, Max? Uh-huh. Oh, have a big stretchy! Come on then, let's go. This is exactly what Hall's Gap is known for, eating an ice cream in the creek. The other kids are in the creek. A lot of people. Let's have something on. Look at the line up for the ice cream. Ooh. That's what people come for. Are they good guys? Are they yummy? That line's still huge. Yum! Coconut ice cream is really nice. It's good. We might not stay though. It seems to be very busy. It's not actually a public holiday. It's only if you choose, yeah, take it off. Choose it to be a public holiday for them. Yeah, it's pretty mental. Haven't done it. It's supposed to be beautiful. It's supposed to be very similar to what. Well, put the stick down. Honey, you're going to get hurt. Oh, you've got a scratch. Thumb in the mouth. Hair up here, giving it a twirl. Get that down. Come on. Hold my hand. Where's Eli? Oh, Look, there's nothing to do than just watch you guys play at parks. You had a pretty big girl at the park the other day, didn't you? Look, we brought you here to have an ice cream. We're not going to stay here because it's so busy. We just wanted to have lunch, have a stop, and then get another hour or so. Another hour or so of driving for finding a spot. That's beautiful out there. Isn't that nice? Hold hands. There it is. Hey. <laughs> you're watching. Look, you're gonna watch the box the ducks race. That's Hall's Gap. Well, Hall's Gap's bigger than that, and it, this is the Grampians. The Grampians is full of beautiful cliffs and walking trails and tracks and everything gorgeous. We cannot hike over these trails, so it's not really worthwhile for us to stay here for an extended period of time. But we're passing through. We did the iconic ice cream here and 
played in the little river stream. And then we also got to watch, yeah, get that out of your mouth. That is grubby. Let's go, walk faster, catch up to dad. That's what it's like having kids. I'll leave that in. Put the stick down. This is like bright. Bry. Bright. No, bright's better than here. But it's just iconic. Like everyone comes here for that ice cream. That's why the ice cream shop's as full as it is. Everyone has memories of that ice cream shop. Eagle camper. Oh, mate. not raining but it's um it's gonna rain straight for like a couple of days so we're coming to the park having some chicken salad let the kids have a run around it's got a cool park and lake and stuff before we have two days of horrible horrible rain Mm -hmm. It's spicy sauce. No, it's not. Actually, I'll have a salad. Nice sauce. Look at the vultures. Spicy sauce. Chop, chop, chop. Some cucumber. Some cucumber. Cucumber. Salad. Chicken. I like cucumber. Yum. Millie got drumstick. Elijah's got drumstick and cucumber. That's got chicken salad. Wing. Maxie's got chicken salad. Yeah. Don't be silly with I got it. tuna salad. Is that good? <laughs> I'll hold ya. Come here. I'll hold ya. Is it sway? Millie's <laughs> always a little bit unsure of things like this. And maybe she gets that from me. Different park? Are we going to do some park? Oh! <laughs> ah, Max! Don't jump the camera. Hold on to the edge. here at Discovery in Warrnambool and we've come back to camp because we are going to have some big gusts of wind. You can probably hear wind but I can't help it. i got a games room here. They have a heated pool. I do recommend it. But I've got some cash. I'm going to let the kids actually play in the games room with money. We never do that. And uh, I just thought the kids will have fun. I don't mind wasting a little bit of money. Oh, oh it's so warm in here. It's not windy. We can chill out. They've where, got a where telly. The, where's the coin? It's up in my hand. We've got air hockey, cars, motorbikes, some like claw machine things. Oh, the claw machine this is free, which is awesome. Not the coin. And there's also a little punching bag. And there's usually very annoying children in here that won't leave you alone. Beep. No, I'm not giving you coins. Why? I am. Hmm. What to play? I'm gonna have a go against Eli of this. Where does the money go? I'm here. How much? Two bucks. You guys, we had the worst luck with weather when we were in Warrnambool we had like I think we stayed there six days in the end and it rained every day we ran out of stuff to do Pete and I were fighting like cats and dogs it was not ideal everything was wet we were wet it was soaked it was freezing cold 
uh, and it was, you know, the start of November, so we weren't expecting it to be that cold, but um, there was a, a snap come through anyway. But uh, this is the end of the video. Um, I tried to keep things as real without clipping too much as possible. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoy. The next video is actually the Twelve Apostles and the Great Ocean Road. So um, I'm really excited to get that one up. All right, thanks guys for watching. Bye.